You know who it is, TDG in the building. John King was really good, family. Man, shit, back in there once again, dog. Well, 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 um, let's see. Um, wait, wait, give me a second, because I have to, you know, figure out, because I watched the last video, and there was something we didn't talk about. There's new shit we gotta talk about. Okay. And stuff, and I'm just right now very confused and sleepy a little. Yeah. So you have to forgive me, you know, for being sleepy. Okay, shit. so what are we going to start with first, then? Well, the one thing we did not talk about in an E3 video was PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale. Uh, it was the reason why you didn't talk about that. What reason was that? What the fuck you mean what reason? That, that shit failed. Okay, okay, okay. Now, I don't think PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale is a failure yet. I don't think that. Hey, fuck that. No, 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 no. Now, that game is a failure. Okay, okay. Fine. You have your opinion. Now I'm finna say some shit. Okay. Now, after we saw that, what I would like to hang my head in shame and call a very horrible display of showing a game, a couple of days later, you know, shout out to all my fighting game fans that watch me. Shout out to Gutex and Mike Ross. Gutex finally, you know, being able to get on camera after impregnating that Peruvian whore. You know, we know you had to hide in the cut so you didn't have to pay child support to the bitch. We understand. Shout out to Gutex. Yeah, I know. Yeah, this is some fighting game community type shit. I, I don't talk to you about this shit because it's just hella drama and motherfuckers. I want one of them whores. You want Peruvian whores? Fuck yes. Why not? Nigga, Peruvian whores on like the whore scale are like really fucking low. Really? Very. Oh. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know, you know, I just think because, you know, the cross County family there in California, I guess, you know, it's real easy to find hoes from Peru, I guess, I don't know. I guess so. But, but, but enough about Gutex and shit and Peruvian whores and impregnation, nigga, use a fucking condom. Um, I, they made a video a couple of days after I watched that E3 shit. And they played the exact same game those motherfuckers on the E3 stage played, but you wanna know what the fucking difference was? What's that? They, when I watched the Cross Counter video, they was mad hype! And when they was on the stage, wasn't nobody getting crunk, wasn't nobody getting amped, wasn't nobody, man, nigga, I'll kill you, nigga, man, fuck this shit! Or something like that. I'm like, you talking to a motherfucking dog that ain't seen nigga get shot over fucking, over Pokemon Stadium, nigga, so... Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I was a little more sad. No, no, it's not, no, it's not that you will be... To people, what do you think the mechanics are and why I would assume that it failed? Well, we've already had this discussion, so I already know the answer. We pretty much at the motherfucking point, like initially when I watched that shit, was we really think a game like that needs fucking life bars. But, Earlier this week, I was over my cousin them house, and I actually played TMNT Smash Up randomly, not knowing that this would even flow into the conversation. Mm -hmm. That's a fucking party fighter with life bars. Okay. And when it works to a degree, when you have life bars instead of let me knock you off the screen, you know what I'm saying? Right. When it came to Smash Brothers, it was always about making sure that the player always had a chance to be in it till they were knocked out, which really added to Smash Brothers' party atmosphere. Mm -hmm. I don't know, honestly, if this is the direction that Superbot wants to go with PlayStation on the Battle Royale. Because in TMNT Smash Up, it, it's like the game mechanics play more like a fighter, but that will probably be explained because Team Ninja helped them make that game. So it was like because I'm getting to damn it. What am I trying to fucking say? Because I, I I don't fucking know. I, I am trying to make a fucking point, but it's hard for me to make sense. Okay, okay, okay. I, I, I got it. I got it. Pl Smash Brothers don't play like a fighter. Uh, I don't care how many hacks you make to brawl. I don't care how gangster melee was, how fucking cool the original 64 game is. Smash is a fighter without actual fighting mechanics. That's that. I don't really want to ever hear it again that their argument in the fighting game community, community period for years is that is Smash a fighting game? 
It's a fighting game because Mario punches the shit out of Sonic the Hedgehog. That defines a fighting game for me right there. I really don't need that old extra fucking fanboy ass bullshit to define it. That's what the fuck it is. The point I am overarchingly trying to make it is that when it comes to PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale, they are trying to go for more of the TMNT smash-up way and being more engrossed in fighting mechanics because they have a lot of people from the fighting game community and people who have experience with fighters and motherfuckers who help make the fucking combo system for fucking God of War making a fucking quote-unquote party fighter. So I really don't think that what Smash Brothers is, I don't think PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale will be that. I don't okay. think that's what we're going for. Now, let's start with what we know. Let's start with the things we saw in the video. That I pretty much wasn't feeling. Let's start with how they have it set up. Now, first, to, to prove my point, I'm going to go to fucking Smash Brothers. Smash Brothers have smash attacks, right? Word. And, and they also have, what, 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 what is that, B down... Be left, right, the the fucking the, the fucking tilts no. and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beat up is a recovery move, right? That's when you fall off train or whatnot. Most, most characters have recovery moves and shit. Well, Correct. All characters do. Um, what I can see in this game, they have it set up to where it seems like you press a single button and it does a single function. Some characters might have a, another function, but it, it, it doesn't have a variety of these. It's, it's like... Basically, you have moves, you do them, and they build up this gauge, and once this gauge reaches a certain level, you'll have something called, what is it, a super or some shit? Yeah, it's a super, just like Street okay, Fighter. Super, yeah. So, you can charge it up, what, to three supers, right? To n not actually three supers, but three levels. Three levels, oh, okay, whatever. Be because, because, whatever. Okay, okay, now. You charge it up to three. Okay. And three is supposed to be the strongest. And uh, gets you the most kills or whatnot. This is correct. Find this shit fucking retarded. So you mean to tell me the only way I can win a match is by building up this fucking cage and unleashing it on my opponent, get a kill, then that's it. What the fuck is this? Well, okay. There are. I like that part of the game, see? That's oh. I, I find that shit troublesome. I thought you were going to use the word ridiculous, but let me try to dial it back. Because maybe I need to re-explain what the hell you just said from a person who has one of the greatest technical minds in all the fighting game community. And yeah, I just said that shit and you don't like it. Fuck you. However, one thing that I do not understand or get at the moment about supers is that I wonder does it work like fighting games where you can stop that super. And then... You, it's like instead of like maybe you want to use a level one super when you have three meters. I don't know if you can do that. But yeah, from what I can see, I don't think you can do that neither. It's like once you go overboard to that, to that two mark or that three mark, that's the shit you're forced to do. Well, I don't know. In game retrospect, as we sit here and talk about that, that that's a good fucking battle system idea. I really think that in order to let me use fighting game terminology and game not period, fucking metagame being able to choose what you can do when you can do it when you have the options instead of limiting my options makes the chess match of your character versus mine what are what is the situation what can I do in situation blah 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 I don't really think having level three and then being like fucking I want to use three level threes instead of one three level or one level three super. Okay. That's bad bitch. Okay, I, I may interrupt you, but a little more on topic with what you're saying. Uh-huh. When it comes to that, I hope that they add something to where you can change the way the game is played. Like, as of right now, the way they have it set up, I like it. So, what exactly would you be looking for? Well, obviously, know what the fuck I'm looking for. I want this shit to play a little more like fucking Smash. Well, so much. No. It don't completely bite on the motherfucker. But, and then again, look how Smash is set up. Uh -huh. you, have, you have a lot of different ways you can play uh, a mode, right? You have 
put man, oh, one man mm. death matches and all this shit. Uh huh. One, one minute matches and all this other shit. Okay, like, okay. Have it set up to where you can, you know, maybe, maybe you can have a mode where it has health bars. Maybe you can have a mode where it has percentage games or some shit. I don't fucking know. So, this, if. This shit they own here where it's just set up to where you go level one, level two, level three with your super. I, I want more than that, man. It's, it's like, come on, man. Do, 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 do something a little more than this shit. Because right, right now, I'm not feeling the way the game is set up. Fair enough. Fair the fuck enough. I, I, I got you. So, what I'm understanding from you is that what you currently see now is like, okay, oh shit, you're the PlayStation 3 party fighter with PlayStation niggas in it. That's cool. <laughs> However, the level shit needs a lot more diversity and you need a yeah, you in order for you to be a satisfied customer of this game is to be diversified in the ways that you can approach and play this game which would and let me use the word deepen the fucking meta game of it if, yes. am i anywhere in the fucking ballpark with that sir yes yes that, that is exactly what i am trying to say okay so in hindsight and retrospect to wrap this part up is that I think the game, when it was displayed on the E3 stage, niggas wouldn't get hype enough. I saw the fucking cross counter video, Gutex impregnates the fucking Peruvian hooker, and he's back on camera, and oh shit, all of a sudden it's fucking hype. Ja King is like, okay, level 3 super, blah, 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 this. I need a diversified way to play my game, and I agree with all fucking points. So, Superbot, hello, if you're listening, um,. My brother needs a more diversified way to play your party fighter, so if when the game come out, if I have the option for fucking light bars or different ways to use my super to deepen his meta game so he enjoys your game more, we'd appreciate that. Thank you. Please, sir, please. Yeah. Now, at first, I really didn't think we were going to have a perfect segue into this, but we do now. On the subject of Smash Brothers, if you even pay attention to the damn minute at any point in time, you may have heard that My Hero Sakurai, Team Star, and all them are teaming up with people from Namco, Bandai, you know, people that make the wonderful games like the Gundam Extreme Versus. No, well, Gundam Extreme Versus, Gundam Versus, the Gundam Versus series. Let me fucking get my shit right. Motherfuckers from the Tail series and Tekken and Soul Calibur. Like, all their major teams are getting a whole bunch of people in there to diversify my Smash game. Well, which I think might be kind of on the sketchy side. Like now, now before you get into that, maybe there is something we need to actually talk about. Okay. It's this. As long as I've been part of the gaming community, when it came to brawl, we were not 100% satisfied with the final product. You know, for 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 me, it was for me, and it's documented on the fucking internet, on gaff, on videos, on everywhere. Too many fucking lab bastards, not enough crystal being half naked with a staff, and not a fucking diversified roster enough for me. Yeah, it was. Yeah, other than that, the game was hot. Yeah, other was. than those three sticking points for me, game was game was the shit. Game control fine for me because I, I if you don't mind me speaking on behalf of both of us, let me say this to the fucking world. We play Smash Brothers to have fun. I'm not really concerned with the fight game mechanics of a with a fighter with Mario in it. If I want to be concerned of mechanics in a fighting game, I have King of Fighters 13 for that shit, and I will fucking go over there for my fucking confusing crazy meta game with fucking hyper drop combos. When it comes to Smash Brothers, I want to fucking pick up a home run bat and knock the shot at you. It's some motherfuckers in y'all know who y'all are. Y'all decided that because Brawl wasn't what you want and it wasn't enough melee for you other than that tripping shit that was bullshit that you want to make your fucking Project M's and your fucking Brawl Pluses and your Brawl Minuses the game wasn't broke why the fuck are you trying to fix it? I'm sorry, I'm gonna say this shit don't get mad at you boy don't think I'm hating on you but how you approach the game and how we approach the game are two different approaches you were trying to play a game that was created for people to have fun and enjoy themselves and trying to make it a lot more serious than it has to be 
No. Now, I'm not going to sit up here and say that, you know, I ain't been looking at Project M because, yo, what the fuck they doing on that shit looks the, like the fucking crack. I need to show you that, by the way, one of these days when you come through. But okay. I get it. I understand that people like to adjust things when it isn't to their liking. And I understand that. From my point of view, Brawl was a game, other than those three second points I talked about earlier, it's fine for a game for me and Jay to sit down and play, for me to go over to my little cousin's house and go kick it with them and play this shit, and ha ha ha, have fun, order pizza, you know, do whatever, whatever, whatever. You people that want to go and fucking reinvent the damn wheel when the wheel is already fucking invented, I fucking get it. I do. And I want to say that I commend your efforts about trying to make a game that you can be satisfied with. But speaking for me and not withstanding speaking for Jay at this juncture, if he disagrees, I like Raw for what the fuck it was. What the fuck it is. The same for Melee and the same for fucking Super Smash Brothers. They're just fun games for me to fucking take characters who shouldn't be beating the fuck out of each other and they beating the fuck out of each other. Exactly. That, that... Here, here's what I think. Okay, go right ahead. Number one, as long as they don't fuck with our double ice, I don't give a shit what they do. Word. As long as they keep that shit the way it is, or me, you can come in with two ice and just like start raping shit. Play the gorilla bastard. Rape. That, that's, that, that, Play. I don't care. It's straight. Word. But here, here's, here's what I'm thinking they should do, which I don't think they're gonna do. But here's what they should do. Uh huh. They should make. They should make two versions within the same game. Now, I know it's a fucking long shot, but that's what they should fucking do. Explain to me, please. They they, they, they should keep how fucking it, it is with Brawl, how the setup is and whatnot with Brawl, add whatever your Namco Bandai character is going to be, whatever, put that, put them characters in with the, with the roster. We want Mega Man. Characters, and you basically make a direct sequel to fucking Brawl. Then you can make another version or if y'all want to try something new, y'all can do so for these funny bastards and make them their version of the fucking game. I will probably try whatever this new version that y'all do, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to, it's going to pale in comparison to Brawl. Maybe, I'm not sure. I have to wait and see some gameplay footage for it, but we'll, we'll get to that when that comes out. I just think they should make two versions of it in the same fucking game. Okay, now... I think I can fuck with you, but at the same time I can't, and I'm going to explain why. I don't really think to get what you want or think they should do shouldn't be approached quite like that. For all... No, 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 let me... Oh, you know that Brawl is not broken. That's the thing. Well, uh, wait, 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 okay, okay. Not I, 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 I can't, no, what, said, look. It was missing a few things. Okay. It wasn't fucking broken. Well, Gerard, tell, tell that to every motherfucker who first met at night, please. See, where it would be, because, see, I'm going to explain something to you. That, that, that's not what I meant by that. I know what you're saying. I know, and that's what, what I, I, I mean by broken is like, how, how should I put this? That you can play the game and enjoy it without it fucking up your good time? Hey, wait, 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 wait. I mean the formula. You know how... Oh, okay. I'm fucking saying the Legend of Zelda series needs to be revamped and shit. The reason why they don't revamp the motherfucking shit is because the formula still works. Oh. The motherfuckers do <laughs> my Zelda game. I fuck because with you. Because of how they got the setup. You go to dungeons, you look for shit, you find keys, you beat Ganondorf's ass, you call it a fucking day. In other words, motherfuckers, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Shit. I'm like, like I said earlier, why you motherfuckers trying to reinvent the wheel? Motherfucker, we got a goddamn wheel, nigga. Fuck out of here with this shit. Done. That's all, that's all I'm fucking saying. Word. I'm saying shit that's not broken should be fixed. Like, 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 like,
Now, go man, I'm hoping they don't fuck it up. It, it, it's cool that members of, you, you say the guys that, that made Tales games, the, the, Tales yeah, games, yeah, the, trying the, to work with this shit too? Yeah, the Tales series, the Gundam vs. series, some niggas from Tekken, some niggas from Soul Calibur, and some motherfucking games too. And now, shit. if they have some fucking characters from the Tales of games in this bitch, Nigga, nigga, well, well, I guess if you go, if we gonna take five seconds for you to fan wake over a series that I've only played one game in. Actually, actually two, actually two, let me not tell that lie. Let, nigga, let me not tell that lie. Well, well, that's wonderful for you. The only fucking games I played was I played a, a, a stitch of Symphonia on fucking GameCube. And I fucking played Tales of Versus because it was a fighting game. And I was gonna do a motherfucking review on it, but then my PSP broke, so fuck it. Tales of Versus for the record was a decent fucking fighting game, but it didn't fucking satisfy fucking Tales fans because it wasn't good enough, and I had to fucking explain that on the other gaff this morning at 2 o'clock in the morning. So fuck it. Whatever. Bottom line is this. Like we said, if it ain't broke, then try to fuck the fix. I understand what you want to do, how you want to do whatever, 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 fuck the fuck with your boy. If it ain't broke, don't fuck the fix, it, all right? Real talk. I'm like, I'm like... I'm pretty sure someone knows what the fuck Smash Brothers is. I'm pretty sure they're going to have these niggas tarnish the fucking franchise. Uh, you're right. I'm just saying, it would be very stupid of them to have outsiders come in and fucking fuck the game up. Come on, man. Get real. Word. Don't do this shit. Please Word. don't. Word. Make sure these niggas know what they're doing. Word. They got time for this. Okay. Now. I want this. To just be the closing moments of this because we got some other shit we got to get to in our little time frame. It's real simple. I just lost the fuck I was gonna say. Oh my god, you're so fucking high right now, aren't you? Nigga, I don't remember the last time I've done drugs. I, I don't. I, I can't tell you the last time I have physically done a drug. I'm trying to lose weight. I'm trying you to be. Take medication, don't you? Fuck no, nigga. Okay. I. That was a long time ago. We're not gonna talk about. Man, the people don't need to know about that. They don't. Motherfuckers that know me from back in the day, y'all know what's up. Just don't be telling motherfuckers. Don't be don't. And when I get famous, don't be checking for me either, trying to write my life story. That's some whole shit. Okay, now I remember what the fuck I was gonna say. Closing fucking thing when we talk about Smash Brothers and and the Namco motherfucking niggas. It's this. Do what you gonna do. Just as long as I don't randomly trip. I don't give a fuck what you do. I'm done. I'm done with the shit. As long as when I when I wipe you with Lucas, he's not randomly tripping as I'm running at you to fucking hit a standing A, I don't give a fuck. I'm done. I'm done. Over with. Fuck. Done. Wrap. Now, we have other things that we need to get to that I don't know, because, like, once we go here, dog, we have never really, we've touched on shit like this, and we fucking said this and that, but we really actually don't give it some fucking time. Okay. I don't know if y'all know, but me and Jay, nigga, we watch some ill-ass TV, we read ill, we, we read ill-ass mangas, we read gangsta, we watch gangsta-ass animes and all that shit, right, and I it's really... Not about, it's not about the game, dog, it's more... There's more to it than just fucking games, although that is the forefront of the shit. Nigga, we entertainment icons, you bitches, or something. Like, I don't know. But, maybe we should take the list of this time, you know, to not talk about Crank That Song, because, nigga, Crank That Super Mario, nigga, because, nigga, where we from, Jay? Where we from? Tell the people, nigga. <laughs> Let's move the fuck Nigga, tell them where we from, nigga. Don't be bashful, nigga. Shut the fuck we from up, Germany, nigga. ho. We from Germany, God. nigga. Shut. Hey, let's move the fuck on. Okay, okay. Where the fuck should we start? I, I, I don't know because we don't always watch the same shit. But I will run down some shit that I personally watch. Shout out to fucking Dallas coming the fuck back. Yeah, I fucking watch Dallas. Don't fucking judge a nigga, nigga. Jr. Ewing is godlike. I don't give a fuck what you say. I don't give a fuck. Larry Hagman like, is like a trillion years old, and he's still a fucking beast at J.R. Ewing. I don't give a fuck. The subject is closed on that shit. Shout out to fucking Burn on this nigga. Um, Michael Weston, greater than sign, yo punk ass. How about that shit? And shout out to fucking Fiona. You know, just, oh my god, dude. Oh man, she, man, that lady like 40-something, dog. Nigga, she up there with like, you know, like 40-year-old, be like, she up there with Tara Strong, dog. And the only reason 
that that Gabrielle was up there with Tara Strong, nigga, is because if you hear her talking like interviews, that Irish accent sexy as fuck, my nigga. But you need to fucking watch Burn Notice. I've been trying to get you on there for years. You know, you don't never want to listen to it. No, you, no, no. You, you never want to listen to a nigga. What else the fuck I randomly be watching? Um, shout out to fucking Thundercats. I really hope Cartoon Network does not cancel that fucking show. That shit is fucking ill. Shout out to Will Friday, you know what I'm saying? He is killing it at fucking Lion. Oh, I really thought he was going to fucking suck and not live up to the Lion legacy, but he killing shit. And I'm like, that show is a lot more adult for a kid's show, and we're about to get into that shit in a second, I know you know what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but shout out to fucking Thundercats going the fuck in. Um, one last thing, I, I really think this, we, this is, I think this is where we get to the joint shit. Okay. Shout out to fucking Steve Bloom and the Tsunami fucking faithful. Thank you, Lord Jesus fucking Jesus A. Cristo fucking Christopher Reed broke your legs. Christopher Reed gave his legs for Tsunami. Suck a dick. Fuck what I just fuck what you heard. Christopher Reed gave his legs off that horse so we could ultimately have Tsunami after Cartoon Network fucked it up the first time. Wow. Wow my ass. Wow my ass. Here, here, dear Tsunami, this is what the fuck you do. Y'all need to start at 8 o'clock. I really don't need to think I need to wait three hours to get to my anime. This is what you do. You go holler at Viz and you tell him that since Disney AD ain't showing Naruto Chapu no more, you want to put that on for an hour at 8 o'clock. You want to follow it up by hollering your niggas over at Funimation and say, we going to start One Piece over from the fucking beginning with the new fucking dub, even though that I do have a affiliation for the four kids dub because the only thing four kids ever could do before they got shut the fuck down, and this is in most motherfucking cases, would fucking cast a fucking show. Other than other, the fucking, the we gon' sister shit, fuck you niggas, all that other shit, but goddamn it, four kids, you could fucking cast an anime. Goddamn it, I fucking said that shit. Four kids, you can cast a goddamn anime, and you know, RIP to you, but I'm gonna give you the proper what it is. But like I said, Funimation, One Piece Dub, 9 o'clock. 10 o'clock, put some random shit. Big ol' IGPX, fucking Rowan Warriors, shit. Re- nigga, Funimation redoes Sailor Moon. I- I've heard rumors. I've been trying to do that for years. Shout out to Lord Bailey. Um, then get to the normal shit. Um, shout out to Dead Man Wonderland being fucking for forcing me to go buy the DVDs. Yeah, I, I-, I see her. <laughs> it goes ham, dude. But I can't understand shit. It's like it's like it's like fifteen minutes of bleep. Big damn. Fucking episode, B. I can't. But see, what the fuck is this shit? Yo. Yo. I can't wait for the motherfucking DVDs to come out, man. Some have to snatch that. Yeah. Shut yeah. Up. But you want to know what those, what Dead Man Wonderland has showed me about you, know what I mean? I'm going to have to buy Panty, Panty and Stocking on Blu ray. Because if Dead Man Wonderland is the bleep, you my bleep, 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 like the thong, the thong, 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 Panty and Stocking is not going to fly. It's not. So, I'm just going to have to buy that on DVD. I'm just going to have to. I don't have a fucking choice. I'm sorry. I just don't. So, it is what the fuck it is. To not be killing it, you know, I, I watch this shit every week. You know, I watch this shit. Even though, you know, um, Bleach is like, and it's like, what? Millions fucking, fucking arc about nothing that has nothing to do with Yuki the Batman fighting Ichigo the fucking... So, uh, I, I think the last filler that we're currently in... Like dinner, uh, almost a fucking year long, though. Lord. We don't watch this fucking film for a fucking year. Dude, dude, how long the fuck did we wait in between the bounce arc and then they took like a fucking two year break and shit? I don't even know remember how long it was. I, I can't remember my damn stuff. Maybe it ain't worth to fucking remember. I guess I don't fucking know. It just take it too fucking long. I wanna see, I wanna see Yuki, Yuki the Trash Man nigga and his Batman form fuck up Ichigo. I've already, I've already replayed this repeatedly in Beach Heat the Soul 7. I just need to see the English dub version. Yeah, I've watched the Japanese dub, so fucking what? I want to watch this shit again. Suck my dick. Whatever. I don't fucking care. I don't fucking care, yo. Just get to that shit. Um, yeah, Toonami needs some work, and all you motherfuckers need to watch that shit, because Toonami is very important, because if it wasn't for that damn block that Cartoon Network showed in the first place, I have no motherfucking idea where anime to fucking be right now. 
that honestly, like I said, if it wasn't for Toonami fucking taking the chance of ultimately getting shows like fucking Dragon Ball Z and Sailor Moon in your damn mind, even though they came on USA first and then they were in syndication, that you owe Toonami. You owe, you owe, you owe if you're an anime fan, you owe Toonami, you, you buy down. You bow down to Toonami. You get on your knees at night and pray for a slap like you a Muslim that you think Toonami is back. You fucking motherfucker. And, and, and you know what? Guess what? What? And guess who created Toonami, nigga? Nigga, who is that nigga? Sosuke Aizen. Oh, damn. The original god. Nigga. Damn. <laughs> he, he was the original god of everything. Yeah, you know what? We, man, we, man, dude, we can do a whole video on, on how Sosuke Aizen is greater than all of us. We can do a whole video on fucking Lord Aizen, nigga. Oh, yeah, you know what? That that's gonna be a future video. I don't even wanna discuss this now. That we gonna do a whole video on how on how fucking Sosuke Aizen is greater than you. It's greater than you greater than fucking everything. Yeah, pretty much. The only thing no I no 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 Except for Christopher Reed. The only thing Aizen is not down to is Reed because Reed is his job. No, fuck that. He's nigga, fuck right. you! Nigga, nigga, fact, nigga, Christopher yeah. Reeves is greater than Sosuke Eisen, yeah. who is greater than everyone else. Yeah, pretty much. Please, motherfucker, play him. No. No, 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 you know what? Shut up. We've wasted enough time on this shit. Shut up. No, we didn't. Yes, we did. Because, nigga, we have two fucking shows to talk about in ten minutes to do so, so let's please fucking do this. Nigga, Young Justice Invasion. What about it? Nigga. What the fuck not about it? It's the fucking greatest cartoon on TV that's not The Legend of Korra, which is not fucking Young Justice Invasion. The fuck I'm talking about? Oh. Nigga. Oh, my ass. Oh, I, 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 hey, hey, shut the hell up, nigga. I know what you're talking about. The show goes ham, dude. Every fucking week. The show goes in, man. Dude, dude, the first season was, uh, it, No, 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 no. I'm going to say, let me say this first. The first season had me wishing that... Teen Titans will come back, and now it is, and the new Jowlin Chronicles and shit. Yeah, motherfucker, I'll keep forgotten to tell your ass. I was gonna surprise your ass on camera. Jowlin Showdown's coming the fuck back, nigga, next year. <laughs> fuck yes, nigga. No bullshit. No gay oops out the problem, your ass. Jowlin Showdown is coming. Nigga, yeah, you need to do research, but nigga, I accidentally bumped into a Terra Strong posted on Twitter. Hi, Terra. <laughs> fuck, you just calling me. I, I call her ass back. Nigga, fuck that. I call her ass back. She, she ain't doing oh, shit. You know what? Oh, you know what? But we're not going to get to that. Yeah, um, I think we pretty much just fucking wrapped up Young Justice Invasion. Young Justice Invasion is God to every yeah, cartoon. That, 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 except for Legend of... Week, it should not be in the time side of hand because this shit is some adult shit. Nigga, they need to put that shit on Toonami and just wrap that shit up. This shit is some adult shit. I want, I want, nigga, I want. Yo, yo, I'm like this. They need to move that shit to later in the night, nigga, and then fucking Artemis can walk around like Shion Uzuki and fucking Xeon Saga 3. Yeah, she is. She sure the fuck needs it. Cold blooded! Yeah, she sure so, so pretty, so pretty much, to, to fucking wrap this, the fucking Young Justice part of this shit up, nigga, Young Justice is God to you, to your fucking TV watching. Go watch that motherfucking shit or I'll bust a cap in your ass. How about that? Yes, sir. Work. Now, let's get to the godlike show, nigga, The Legend of Korra, and uh, at first, it started out slow, I'm like, oh shit, it's a girl, Avatar, blah, 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 whatever. The Legend of Korra, the hardest motherfucking show on TV, Hard and you- fucking show, and fuck with this nigga saying, the motherfucking Avatar process starts in the balls. In the balls, nigga. in the balls. In the ball sack. Ball sack. In the ball, ball nigga, look. We, we had this discussion a couple days ago just randomly that we had our theories that Amon might be some twisted zombie version of Aang or some shit which would explain why he could fucking take a nigga bending. But it kind of brought the question, how in the fuck is the Avatar chosen? Is the Avatar just is like you randomly come off random coochie and oh shit I'm the Avatar? Is it that somebody's balls is like injected with avatar juice to make them make avatar babies with them pop out and can do three elements like when they five years old what the fuck i think i need to go holler at michael d martino and ask him how does the fucking avatar cycle start does it start in my ball so does that mean i can go out here in these streets right now go find me a random hole get that bitch and if I and if I and the fucking eyes up right, that my random whoever will fucking come out of the fucking avatar is that how the fuck it works? 
Because it's got to be more than the four elements in harmony, blah, blah, blah. This is real bullshit. And, uh, speaking of breeding, uh-huh. nigga, you know I was about to touch this fucking subject. What? I'm going to need you motherfuckers to sound off in the comments below and let me know what y'all think. Any Legend of Core fans out there, why the fuck are there no hybrids in this motherfucking series? Oh, we, we had this discussion, too. Fuck that shit. Let, oh, let me be a fucking hybrid. Let, let me fucking... Hey, hey, fuck that. He's no, 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 no. No, I'm explaining to the... How this motherfucking dude who oh. can only use airbending? How he can only do airbending? That's fucking stupid. He should be able to do water building as well. What the fuck is that about? Word. I'm just saying, man. That, that It's like some shit doesn't make sense. It's like they totally forgot the fucking hybrid process. What the fuck? I, look, maybe that's uh, another question I'm gonna ask him. Like, okay, let me explain to you what Gerard is talking about. He is talking about Tenzin. That you have an uh, you have an airbender father and a water bending mama who's godlike. Why the fuck he come off and only do airbending? Exactly, that shit just stupid. That doesn't make no, 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 sense. but see, but see, I just fucking thought of something. There can't be a hybrid because that would fuck up the fucking specialty of Avatar, whoever the fuck you are. Fucking what, dog? You just don't fucking take out the fucking hybrid rule just because of that. Nigga, 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 wait, nigga, wait, wait. Was that even a hybrid rule in the first fucking place? Fuck that. If you don't bring two abnormal motherfuckers together, yes, I call them abnormal. Damn. If you don't bring two ab- different abnormal motherfuckers together. It should make a fucking super abnormal child. No, 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 no. No, it gets fucking better than that. Imagine if Lynn would have stayed with Tenzin and they had Bay. Oh, oh shit. damn. Lynn, Lynn Bay Fong is godlike. She's the nigga. She better than fucking Cora. She's godlike to that show. Poor, poor thing that happened to that fucking woman, a mind hey, you hey, bastard. When you fucking metal bend your clothes on, nigga? It's a fucking rap. It's a fucking rap. Who does that? I find that sexy. You man, you fucking use your avatar power to put your drawers on, nigga. I'm done with you. I'm done. We tired. We t- it's time, nigga. When you put your clothes on by metal bending them to your pussy, it's time to it's time to bow down to a nigga greater than you. Fuck that. It's done. Done. You you have to bow down to shit like that. I'm sorry. And, and you know what? I think she's the only motherfucking bitch that's worthy. Of Marion fucking Lord Eisen. You you really think that Lord, Lord Eisen's mate is Lynn Bay Fong? You you really think? Eyes the fuck and have babies. Uh, man, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Lynn would probably tentacle rape the shit out of Lord Eisen, dude. <laughs> That's she would metal tentacle rape this nigga. That's probably what he wants, nigga. I don't know. I don't know, but let me see. We got a little time left. That pretty much to summarize what the fuck you may or may not have heard. The avatar process starts in your ball. Yes, that somebody's balls are, are tingled with and they pop out avatar. In, in the nutsack, nut nut nigga. Nigga, that, nigga, Amon, nigga, Amon is zombie Aang. Nigga, Lin Bay Fong is greater than you, who is greater than Lord Eisen, and fucking Christopher Reeve is greater than all them. That's just how the fuck it is. Now, um, really quickly before we get the fuck out of here, shout the fucking True Blood. Season, what season is this? Season 5, I think, right? 6.30? I don't... I think it's... Yeah, 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 I believe it's season 5. Yeah, season 5 going to... I'm probably second-guessing what season was. The last season fell kind of short, so... Fell kind of short? Nigga, I want to shoot myself. I, 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 I have no word but fucking you and how horrible season 4 was and, and how you don't know the the... the it ain't, it ain't, you can't read the books that cheated the show no more. No, you it's, can't. You're done. You're done. So, watch the show, calm the fuck down, and do that. Um, other shows, watch fucking Common Law, that's the shit. I love that show right now. That's my fucking secret show right now, fucking Common Law on USA. That's the fucking shit. So, watch that too. Secret show? Yeah, it's my secret hey, show. Man, secret show can kiss my secret ass. Yeah, yeah. You know what else can kiss my... You know what else can kiss our secret ass, nigga? The CW. I ain't forgot about you motherfuckers gonna cancel the secret circle. Bitch. Yeah. Cancel the secret circle on us, nigga. We shanking niggas now. We're really fucking good. I'm We're fucking really... the Terminator back. Put that nigga back in there. 
so he can fucking caress that black skull. Nigga, the black skull that came out of white nut out of fucking river, nigga. <laughs> nigga, we want to see more Blackwell kids, nigga. We nigga, nigga, Blackwell kids, nigga. We don't die, nigga. We multiply, nigga. Baby, nigga, what's really hurt? Fuck it. Them niggas should be Lord Eisen's tax force. Nigga. We doing that, nigga. Lord Eisen, nigga. Lord Eisen. Bow down to Lord Eisen. Nigga, we don't care. We don't, we ain't gonna see him in the manga no more. We don't give a fuck. But Lord Eisen is greater than you. So suck balls, nigga. We don't give a fuck, nigga. Nigga, shout the chat the Mexican Slayer, nigga. He weak to his own weapons, nigga. Bullet bills and oranges, nigga. Throw that shit. We'll explain to you in another motherfucker. Word. Nigga, who the fuck out of here, nigga? Ja King, any point words, nigga, y'all know how much time you got? Oh, really, uh, shit. Oh. Wait, whatever, all the fuck the shit we just said. Yeah, fuck, fuck you, suck our balls, uh, nigga. Not... Fuck you, suck our balls, nigga. We don't care, nigga. Pretty much, nigga. Avatar process in the nuts. Hell yeah. Um, Get and shit. Nigga, we'll be the fuck, we'll be the fuck back next week or some shit. Nigga, until then, nigga, I'm triple the guy. Ja King, my big brother, nigga, we run this YouTube shit. Uh, Fucking uh, hoe ass, niggas. We get this shit. Nigga, holla at y'all, nigga. Peace the fuck out.